with you? Yeah, that's what we do. Hi. Hi, baby. Hi, baby. She has not left this run since May. Yep. Four months. Four what are we? months. Whoa. Oh, oh it's terrifying. Wow. Hi, I know. Come on. Hi, Tina. Hi, baby. Oh, wow. Her little brain was. Come on, girl. Good girl. Come on, Pep. Pep um, came to us from Clovis, New Mexico, with her six puppies who all tested positive for distemper. And she, we just got confirmation today that she is off quarantine, so she gets to go out and about. Go right. So we took her to the dog park. First time ever. <laughs> Pips! <gasps> Come on! Wow! Come on. She's like, I don't run. Yeah, I mean, Pet really went through it all. She um, had really high fevers when she was at her sickest. She was having seizures because of it. Um, she really has just come out the other side the most perfect dog. Um, a lot of dogs, if they were going through this same situation, would kind of lose their minds. And Pet has kept her cool. She's really just a perfect perfect little lady. It's lonely to sit alone for mm -hmm. for weeks on end mm -hmm. so we were just trying to make sure that she knew she was loved and had company and I think part of your healing process is you got to know that you're loved. Yeah. It's a big part, huh? The hope is that she will just go home, get a nice family who loves her and who will treat her like the princess that she is. <laughs>